Yes, sir. What's up, everybody? Your boy, Joshua Garza. Much love and God bless. So today's video, you know, if you're unaware, uh, last March, so about a year and a couple months ago, uh, I had ACL surgery, ACL and meniscus surgery. And I had a torn ACL for about seven years until I found out I had a torn ACL. Went to the doctor and he right away pulled on my knee and he's like, yep, yeah, your ACL is gone. I was like, you know, damn doc, I, I knew something was up but not that bad. So that was a whole experience in itself. And just thinking about it right now and just going back in my mind, uh, what an experience, what an experience. And I just have a, such a humbleness and a gratefulness. You know, at first I was like, oh, like, you know, God, let me, uh, you know, let me, be strong again, let me be, you know, let me be able to run again and be my stronger than ever. But I came to realize, like, I'm just lucky to have both my legs, you know? I'm just lucky to walk. So when you, when you get that in your head and how lucky you are, so that will help you in your recovery. Uh, let me show you my legs. If you go back to my uh, my leg video, when I, it was like day two, day three of my uh, ACL surgery, I took the bandages off. If you look at my right knee, my knee and my thigh look so tiny, man. Oh, it was like almost like cringy to look. It looks so tiny. And I, I feel bad for, I, now I look back at it and I, I really feel bad for my uh, ex-girlfriend, Lana, because, you know, she, she did help me. She was a good, for a month, I was very grateful for that. For that whole month, the first month of my surgery, she really helped me out and her mom included. Uh, but she definitely saw me at the worst and that probably wasn't the best, you know. Uh, but I also had my dad as a nurse as well. He wasn't he was a little rough on the edges But he was really good, too. I'll tell you a little quick little story uh, It was like the second night and I was downstairs because I, I couldn't go upstairs and I remember I couldn't reach my crutches So I couldn't get up and my phone was not near me and my dad I hear my dad snoring upstairs. I'm like dad Dad, I must have yelled for like 20 minutes before you heard me. So just doing that just feeling so helpless You know, I couldn't get up feeling so helpless, you know what that does to you and you know, it was a struggle, but you know, obviously I came back stronger and better than ever. So let me show you my leg right now. This is how we're looking. You know, it's a lot stronger. I got some muscle now. You know, calf gain. Calf gain, you know. Uh, yeah. There's been a lot of people that hit me up, you know. You know, it's been amazing to watch your recovery. Uh, it's been helpful for them to watch my videos and just to see what I've been through and knowing that they're going through the same thing. And, you know, all I can say is mentally, you know, Know that you will come back stronger. Thrive to come back stronger. So now, today, nowadays, uh, my knees. You know, if I don't, so if I don't stretch out my knee every day, uh, I will feel it. It will begin to get a little tight. Uh, but I can fully bend it. You know, I can fully go to my uh, butt. You know, bend my back I, as before. I couldn't, but you know, I can touch my butt. Garage is a little dirty. You know, I wouldn't say I'm 100% because I still feel it, it still gets a little tight. And not only that, my left knee, because I said like I w literally went seven years of a torn ACL and I felt like my left knee compensated, uh, you know, for those seven years. So my left knee kind of bothered me here and there, to be honest. Uh, so it's kind of, you know, it's a little weird, but then I think, you know, oh, my knees, but like, hey, I'm just grateful to have my both legs, you know, two legs. But, you know, I've done, so I, I, in the gym, I hit legs and I put a lot of weight on, so, but I have yet to like fully test it and like play basketball, like go 100%. So I'm gonna go today and see, because at the gym they finally put up the rims, but I'm, I'm capable of doing many things. Let me show you what I can do. My takeoff's pretty good. So I can do all that, just doing that, you know, I'm grateful. I look pretty good, right? I look, I can move. You do this. This is my knee right here I had surgery on. So as you can see, got some muscle, you know? Got a little muscle. And my scars right here is the meniscus one. Not, you know, not big at all. And then this one over here, not, you can't even see where they made the two little holes. But it's like right here. Let's see one. And the other one, I'm not even sure. I'm not even sure where that's at. <laughs> so as you can see, you know, you can barely see the scars. You just see the meniscus one more than the other. But 
definitely grateful to have both legs. <laughs> if you're going through it right now, just know it does get better. By the time, you will get stronger. And if you have that mentality, you'll be stronger than you ever were before. I do feel like now that my ACL is you know, healed and my meniscus in the gym, they're getting bigger now. As before, I was never able to build up my legs because I had a torn ACL. I never knew, like, oh, my legs can never get that big. Even though, like, around my legs, you know, it was strong. But, like, my legs never could grow. My legs are growing now. My pants are getting tight. My shorts are getting tight. My underwear get tight. I get wedgies in the gym all the time. So, I guess that's good. And if you're going through it right now, I know it's hard. I know you feel helpless. I know the feeling mentally and physically. It's very, very hard. But stay strong. Come back stronger. Have that mentality. Prove everybody wrong, you know? Prove everybody wrong and just have a gratefulness that, you know, you do have both your legs and you already won right there. You already won. Much love as always. Your boy Joshua Garza. God bless.